So the question I want to put to you is, what if most of what we know about leading is wrong? Or at least not relevant to the times in which we find ourselves right now? So what I think we actually may be our most fundamental mistake is looking for singular heroes. Now, we naturally go there. We humans are storytellers. It's how we learn. It's how we've done this for millennia. And our basic narrative structure has a hero and anti-hero, a protagonist and antagonist. And that's where stories work, and they work really well. Unfortunately, that's not how life happens. That's not how our work in organizations happens, our work in communities. It's much more communal. And again, we humans are a social species. This is how we naturally interact. And so I think this is the lesson we have to take, is that we have had the structure of thinking about leaders as these heroic individuals, when yes, there are people who are heroic, and yes, there are those who are indispensable, but it's always in the context of a group. Steve Jobs at Apple had Steve Wozniak, later had Tim Cook. Everywhere you look, we have this collective action. So that's where I think we talk about how do we fix what was wrong and how do we get it right going forward when we face so many complex challenges? It's to embrace this idea of communities of leading. That individuals come together and they have a role, but they have a role together as well. And we have to seek to develop ourselves in this more social context, draw upon our natural social strength as humans.